Welcome again to another session. The session today is about uh, reflection. Uh, is, uh, the topic is a transformation. But you're going to deal with the second example of, uh, ref of transformation, which we call reflection, especially reflection along the line y is equal to x. So the third form of reflection is a reflection along reflection along a line along a line y is equal to x. Twenda kuangalia reflection along the line y is equal to x. Sasa hii hapa simbo ya kinafo unyishi kwa mba ni reflection along. Sasa wakati mgini wa siku andike hivu wakandikea tu uh, labda kwa mafumbo au kwa alama zake. Kwa hiyo ahikuambia by sign a symbol of reflection. Symbol of reflection tuwajio kwa ni m. Sasa hili kuhonyesha ni y along y is equal to x. Along the line y is equal to x. Kwa hiyo kwa y is equal to x. Point x y. Hii hapa ndo reflection along the y is equal to x. Point zako hizi unakutu mepewa. Then let us uh, say consider we have a point maybe x y uh, along uh, the x y plane. So sasa tunaenda kuangalia uh, reflection along the line y is equal to x. Tunafanyaje? Kitu cha kwanza lazima tu, tuweze kupata ka formula. Tukapata ka formula ndo twende sasa tukafanye maswali mbalimbali. Uh, consider this is x and y plane. This is x and y plane. Aksema y, this is x. Aksema y is equal to x. Manake nini? Wa, wakati y napo kwa naongezeka, lazima na x ya naongezeka. Haya, x ya kiwa napungua, manake na y ya napungua. Kumbe ya samsa manake, msali wetu sisi utakuwa ni hapa katikati. Hivi. Hasa kama kiwa ni hapa katikati. Haya, ashumu kwamba, tuna point sisi hapa. Labda ashumu, this is 1, this is 2, this is 3, this is 1, this is 2. Uh, this is the three. Ha, hivi. Ashumu tuna pointi hapa. Hii pointi bana iwe nda object yetu. X, Y. Sasa, kwa kuwa mesema Y is equal to X. Manaki nini? Haya. Tukija kuweka a uh, plane mirror here. Hapa katikati. Tukiweka. Manaki, sisi hiyo plane mirror. Plane mirror kile kiyo. Hakita anza kuonyesha value ya X. Kita anza kuonyesha value ya Y kwa huku kwenye image yake. Kama tunaelewana. Tukiweka hapa kiyo, kitu gani kitatokea? Tukiweka hapa kiyo hapa. Tukiweka hapa kiyo, manaki kitu ambacho kitafata. Hii plane mira haitaanza kuonyesha value za x. Ile itaanza kuonyesha value ya y huku kinyume chake. Nadhani hapa tunaelewana. Kwa mfano, ukienda thaluni, yule kinyozi akiwa ya anakunyoa, yani ukiangalia pale kwenye kiyo, unakuwa unaona anatumia mkono wa kushoto, kumbe anatumia mkono wa kulia. Kwa na sisi ndivyo inavyokuwa. Kwa kumbe sasa tukiwa tuna tukiweka hapa the plane mira. What happened? Kwamba image yetu itaanza kuonyesha value za y. Kwa mfano hapa y ilikuwa ni mbili. Hapa y ilikuwa ni mbili tukiweka hivi. Manake y hapa ilikuwa ni mbili. Lakini sasa tukiweka a plane mira, itaanza mwanzo ni huko object inaanzia x kuonekana baadaye y. Lakini once we press the plane mira hapa, haitaanza kuonyesha value ya x. Kwa hiyo itaanza kuonyesha value ya y. Na sisi value hapa ni mbili. Kwa maana itaanza kuonyesha y ikiwa ni mbili. Hapo baadaye ndo atafuatia nani? x. Kumbe sasa value ya y itabadilika. x hapa alikuwa ni tatu. Sasa x anaanza kuanza huku tena. Kwa hiyo anahamia kwenye upande wa y. Halafu yule value wa y anahamia kwenye upande wa x. Kwa ndivyo inavyokuwa. Kwa hiyo inaonyesha kinyume kinyume chake. Kwa maana yake point yako sasa itakuwa somewhere here itakuwa a uh, itakuwa somewhere ya here hivi kwa value wa x anahamia kwa y value wa y ana value wa y anahamia kwa x likewise kwa ndivyo inavyokuwa jamani kwa hiyo hapa sasa tukikata hivi utajikuta hizi zinatengeneza a uh, nyuzi 90 na hata hapo ukikata nyuzi 90 maana yake inakuwa ni nusu yake ambayo ni itakuwa ni nyuzi 45 kumbe tukiweka kio katika nyuzi 45 itakuwa inaonyesha kwamba kinyume cha huyu jamaa Kwa hapa sasa itakuwa p dash x y this is will be the image. Sasa kama hiyo ndo itakuwa image. Sasa kitu gani ambacho kitaendelea? Haya kitu ambacho kitaendelea sasa itakuwaje? Hatukija kwenye upande wa coordinates ambao tumezipata. Haya coordinates. Then nukta tu zipata. Tunaanza na x dash. x dash. Ukiangalia hapa x dash. Maana yake tunasoma. Mwanzoni x hapa ilikuwa ni tatu. 
hapa tukiashumu mwanzoni x ilikuwa ni dash nilikuwa ni tatu lakini sasa x dash angalia x dash maana yake tutasoma ya huko itakuwa ni mbili kwa hiyo mwanzoni mbili ilikuwa ni value ya nani ilikuwa ni value ya y kwa sasa hivi imebadilika x dash atakuwa ni mbili ambao mbili ilikuwa ni value ya nani ya y kumbe hapa atakuwa ni y halafu y dash haya y dash hapa sasa hivi y dash ni tatu lakini mwanzoni hii tatu ilikuwa ni value ya nani ya x kumbe atabwada badilishana wanakuwa kinyume kwa huyu atakuwa ni x Hatukija hapo tu represent kwenye uh, coordinates tu represent kwenye linear equation kwamba once we express once we express in a uh, linear equation kwenye tuki express kwenye linear equation hapo inakuwaaje inakuwa hivi x dash ni sawa sana haya tunaandika 0 x zen plus r uh, y okay tukija kwenye coordinate ya y inakuwa y dash this is equal to kwa atakuwa hapa kwenye x atabadilika hapa kwenye ambapo tulianzia sisi x atabadilika kwa atakuwa ni x then plus 0 y ambapo hapa sasa itakuwaaje hapa itakuwa tukiandika katika mtu a vector form vector vector form itakuwaaje itakuwa x dash y dash this is equal to tunaanza hapa ni 0 moja kwa itakuwa 0 1 hapo hapa itakuwa 1 then 0 hivi kwa tukiandika ka general formula general formula yake sasa general a uh, general formula ambayo utakuwa unaitumia wewe kufanya maswali mbalimbali inasema x dash y dash this is equal to 0 1 then 1 0 then x y baada ya hapo so this one represent the image this represent the trans transformation and the last one present the given the given point kwa hii hapa ndo general formula utakuwa unatumia kufanya maswali mbalimbali kama endapo amekwambia find the image along along the uh, y along the line y is equal to zero. kwa form 2 kwa form 2 inakuwaaje kwa form 2 the general formula yake itakuwa ni hivi uh, m y is equal to x means that reflection along the y along the y along, along the line y is equal to x then point x y given this is equal to m y is equal to x dash hivi half point dash point ambazo utakuwa umepewa maana yake utafanya cha kufanya huyu x mnaishuche chini value ya y ipandisha juu kwa hiyo itakuwa y then x hii pia itakuwa inakusaidia. Ukitumia formula form 2 na form 4 zote unapata jibu ni moja. Hakutoka hapo namba tuangalie mfano. Ah, uh, let us see the example number 1. Our example number 1 state that finding finding the image find the image of a point. Assume our point is 3, comma maybe 4. After refraction along why this is equal to x hatua ya kwanza wewe usipani kiandika solution mwandiki hiyo point ulizopewa ni 3 4 kama hivi 3 4 are the given point kwa tunacho ndo ukifanya wewe insert the general form inasemaje nasema x y x dash y dash this is equal to our transformation is 0 1 uh, 1 0 hivi baada hapo x y then unaanza ku substitute kwa tukwaje itakuwa haya unaanza 0 1 1 0 hapo x and y ndio zile point ulizopewa our given point is 3 4 so write 3 then 4 haya baada hapo tunaanza huyu mara huyu unapata 0 then plus 4 times 1 you get 4 right then 3 times 1 you get 3 plus this you get 0 kwa hapo utakuja upate moja kwa moja itakuwa 4 3 So this will be the image. So we we'll write the the conclusion. Therefore the image is a 4 3. Sasa ukiangalia maana yake mwanzoni ilikuwa kinyume. Mwanzoni point tuliyopewa ni 3 4. Again sasa hivi image tuliyopata ni 4 3. Maana yake hapo utaona tayari kuna some changes the values are x na nani? x na y. Hai alternative. Kwa form ya form 2 usipate shida hapo ni dakika moja ushamaliza swali kwa hiyo tamaandikia utamwandikia je hai from kwa form 2 nasemaje form ni nasema y is equal to y deflection ambayo ni m is equal to y y is equal to x then point ni x y 
So our image is will be my this is equal to x dash point dash this one. Kwa bada kwa ndika y haya tuna fanya exchange. Y ananzia x ya nashuka chini hivi. Bada hapo kusabustuti. Kwa takuwa sasa image itakuwa ni haya tunanza value ya y value ya y kule itakuwa ni ni value ya x ni tatu. Tukifata hii hapa formula yetu. Kwa manaki utakuwa mkutu sama the image is 4, 3. Unaishia pali. Thank you for watching.